Hey guys. Welcome to our channel. Civil Engineering Guru. Hope you all are fine. As you all know that. In previous video. We have discussed some definitions used in surveying. So let's move towards our today's topic that is. Types of benchmark used in surveying. So move towards our today's topic. Benchmark. Benchmark is a permanent and temporary reference point in surveying. The term is usually applied to any item used to mark a point as an elevation reference. Types of benchmark. It is a relatively permanent point of reference whose elevation for some assumed datum is known. It is a starting and ending point in leveling. The following four types of benchmarks are commonly used. GTS benchmark, permanent benchmark, arbitrary benchmark, temporary benchmark, GTS benchmark, a GTS benchmark full name Great Trigonometrical Survey. GTS is permanently fixed reference survey station. Having known elevation. Related to respect related. Mean sea level. A benchmark value is quite essential. In any survey area. Especially for the reduction of sea level. Concerning mean sea level or CD chart datum. While carrying out a bathymetric survey. Of a survey area. The datum referenced values. So obtained are utilized to compute. The final depth contours of the survey area. For chart datum, thus, a benchmark, having known elevation, is quite essential in the survey area. Without that, preparation of a bathymetric chart is impossible. In some places, GTS benchmarks are available within a kilometer distance and can be easily moved to the survey area by fly leveling using an automatic level instrument along with a graduated leveling staff. However, in the majority of the cases, GTS benchmarks might be at much away distance in the area to be surveyed. In such cases, the most common traditional way of transferring the benchmark value using an automatic level instrument is a difficult job, consuming an enormous amount of time and labor. To eliminate this process, a method is suggested in this technical report to move the GTS benchmark from any distance to the survey area. The latest digital total station DTS is a tool which may be used for this purpose. The main advantage of applying this method is a considerable amount of time could be saved while maintaining the required accuracy. Permanent benchmark. Permanent benchmarks are fixed reference points established by government agencies like the erstwhile public works departments in certain states. Starting from the standard benchmark such as GTS, conspicuous points onto culverts, bridges and buildings are normally chosen. The exact position of the benchmark might be marked with a small rectangular arrow. A bronze tablet might also be utilized. Permanent benchmark. Set up by state government agencies. Like the Public Work Department PWD fix such a benchmark. Arbitrary benchmark. Arbitrary benchmarks. In most engineering projects. The difference in elevation is much more. Important compared to a reduced level. When it comes to mean sea level. In these cases. The elevation of a permanent structure such as a corner of the plinth of a building, might be assumed to have an arbitrary reduced level, like 100 meters or 500 meters. All these benchmarks are quite useful in small projects. Not temporary benchmark. This type of benchmark, TBM, is established at the end of the day work. Next day work might be continued from there. Such point ought to be to a permanent object to ensure next day it's easily identified. If you guys enjoyed our today's video, then like, comment and share our today's video and subscribe our channel Civil Engineering Guru and support our channel to grow more. Thank you. Bye.